press that list one, two, three. Now pushing the wall. Give him a fight, don't let him come in. Let get four, three, two, yeah. three. And swing in those arms. Standing tall is four, three, two. Now to the side again. And Sit and be fit, baby. Drop my rock. Howdy, folks. Welcome back to you, me, and the movies. And brains. I like brains. Yeah, you do. We got another Return of the Living Dead to watch. Sweet. So we're going to wrap it up. There's a lot of mo more movies in this. A lot of more movies? There's a lot of more movies in this franchise. But really, I feel like this is just a good duology. Mm. Like, Caps it off pretty like the good. The third here. one kind of goes Takes in a it different, too far. different direction. Mm. This one is a great companion to the original. Okay. You'll see some familiar faces from the first one. And the, th and the, the atmosphere feels similar. It kind of feels... Okay. The tone is similar, right? And uh, so ex since Exploded Boot requested this, I was like, you know what? We're just going to get both movies off our shelf. Take care of it. Take care of Take it. Take care of business. Yeah. Exploded Boot uh, said Return of the Living Dead was one of his favorite movies growing up. Mm. And that they had, him and his buddies had to replace the VHS. Oh, because they played it out too hard? Yeah. And not just because Trash got naked over and over again. She was naked the whole time she was on so. screen. Do you, are you hoping for some more Yumi and the boobies and bushies? Um, I'm not like hoping, but if it happens, it happens. Cause I know why. Here for it, <laughs> you yeah. and every teenage boy. Yeah. Well, are you ready to get some more uh, brains on the menu? Yeah, I guess so. Let's do it. But first, like, comment, subscribe, come hang out with us for Return of the Living Dead Two. Two. And check out our Patreon link down below for early access to our latest one. Come here, access to polls, up to pick up watch next. Links down there. Check it out. Let's watch Return of the Living Dead Part Two. Here we go. This is two hours. No, it's ninety minutes. Not even. Oh, that's the best. Oh, it's past my bedtime already. Part two. Department of Ar Army Toxic and Hazardous Waste Unit. Oh, Thom. Thom Matthews. Yep. Remember him from the first one? Um, <laughs> yeah. He was no. Freddy in the first one. That's Tom Matthews. He played uh, um, Tommy Jarvis. Ah, yeah, yeah. Dude, he died, though. Freddy's dead. Is he, though? Undead, perhaps. He's always like, Tina! Right? That was her name, Tina. <laughs> Tina, I can smell your brains! <laughs> okay, we've seen these before. Are these the original that got lost? Is this the origin story? That street looks familiar. I feel like I saw that street in one of the Halloween movies. Yeah, it did look a little bit like Hatfield or what's yeah. it called? Haddonfield. Haddonfield, yeah. Like the second one. Like yeah. the hospital one. Yeah. Into the drinking supply. Lovely. Ah, uh, Pennsylvania. I like those comics. All right. I guess this isn't Pennsylvania anymore. It's definitely California. I mean, yeah, terracotta tile roofs. I feel like you see a lot of I was of kind of joking because the first one takes place in... Pennsylvania? Yeah. You're in. <laughs> what do you know? You want to see the clubhouse? Uh, I've got a homework. My sister, she's waiting for you. Too scared? Me? Scared? <laughs> <laughs> Is your audio just a little weird? Like, yeah, it's off a, balance in the ears? A little bit. Okay. It's a low budget film. It's almost echoey because I hear it in one ear and then the other. Who's buried in here? <laughs> 
Come on, I'll show you inside. Uh, I really gotta get back. My sister. We got a meeting. I thought you were scared. That was before. <laughs> You don't want to be in this club. It's a good thing he knew he could fit through those bars. Yeah. Look <laughs> out, they all float down there. Oh, don't talk about that. What do you think? Don't know, might be supplies. What kind of? Ammo, maybe. Combat stuff. Check this out. Could be a rocket launcher. Well, that's traumatizing. Call that You're not gonna tell him about this, see? Oh. Know why? Because you won't be able to. That's pretty fucked up. Just hope everybody's still buried in there. Is that him? Yeah. It's both the guys from the... They're playing different characters. Yeah. <laughs> All night or what? A couple of hours topped. You wait here. Oh, gee, that sounds really exciting. And will you be careful, too, please? That's how you make sure I'm careful. Sticking my tongue down your throat? Yeah. Totally. Oh, there are all sorts of crazies out there. They want the skulls from interred bodies. That's the key, see? They gotta have been interred. No, serene. nobody wants skulls that haven't already been buried. Come on, I mean, how are they gonna know the difference? It would be dishonest to give them skulls that weren't buried. What's so special about buried skulls? No idea. Insect activity? Oh, boy. Poor life choices. He's trying to get out. I know, but still. Ah! Poor life choices. Okay. Okay. Just a little decayed matter. Nothing to get on him, Oh, shit! <laughs> uh, lousy kids are always poking around in my garden. Well, now you can get out. Why isn't he saying anything? He could be like, help! Let me out of here. Are you I get in here again, I kick your ass, and then I call the police. I mean, he doesn't want to be in there again either, you know? Shame. It's not even ripe. Damn kids, they got no respect for the dead. I think there's fresh bodies in that mausoleum? Maybe. Take it to the side, press out its one. Now pushing the wall, give him a part, don't let him come in again. Four, two, three, 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 two, Why would getting the code wrong release the gas that turns everybody into zombies? He said it was wrong. It was maybe a warning. He got the code was four five. <laughs> That's a lot of gas. I feel like this gas had to be like part of the weather control system that they're trying to invent. Maybe. That's why it always rains when it leaks. Hmm. Mixes with the atmosphere. Weather control gone wrong. Yeah. Could be. Ooh, she's pretty. Not bad. Nice bit of rump in her time, huh? <laughs> Don't be make it weird. I mean, he just made it weird. Just gonna take the head. Just the skull. 
kiss, Ooh. kiss. <laughs> Oh, that's it. I, I don't need the money. I'm out of here. Ah, come off it. Who's gonna know? Huh? <laughs> Her ghost's gonna haunt the shit out of him. I don't think she's gonna be a ghost for much longer. Her undead body's gonna haunt the shit out of him. <laughs> don't give that to your girlfriend. That's yeah. gross. It's bad luck to give somebody jewelry from a dead body especially if you steal it from the dead body yeah what is that stuff swamp gas makes my skin feel like it's a slimy ice or something slimy ice 1957 perfect it's a good year Master Man was my favorite superhero growing oh. up. Well, they're going to be uh, dead. Dead soon. Mm -hmm. Are they going to be on top of it this time because they get a notification that that bell went off or something? Maybe. Not again. Oh, somebody called it in. But they're missing one. Yep. But, but how the hell do you separate a white from a yellow? This, this whole thing is so stupid. It's really easy to separate a white from the yolk, actually. You can honestly just grab the yolk with your hands if you want. That's what I do. Just give it one of these. Yeah. Uh, or do the back and forth on the shell TV, thing. I have an installation order here. Yeah, you were supposed to be here like three hours ago. Don't you go to Central? So I graduated last year. Maybe you remember me, Tom Essex? Student council, swim team. Cable guy. Cable guy. No, no, I don't remember you. Um, TV's in here. He remembers you. Oh no, where are you going, buddy? Just gonna go master man that barrel. You opened that thing, didn't you? Say anything about this, and your ass is grass. Jesse, that's all now. You shut up about this, or else. Or else your brains are first. <laughs> the storyline is just riveting so far. What were you hoping for? I don't know. Something a little bit more interesting. Well, he's going in. Dumb kid. He's got his mask on and goggles. Whatever was in there is no longer. He went for the number. That's a good kid. Maybe a bit too late, but... Uh... Oh, shit! Run! Oh, jeez. Those tar guys. Real creepy looking. I want your brains. At least he's a slow moving one. Yeah. He That's probably good for the water supply. It. Yeah, no joke. Keep keep moving, buddy. Get out of there. Get out of there. Get out of there. They're all busting out of their graves now. Oh, we got another layer of smoke rolling in, huh? Swamp gas. I just really had to show it one more time. Ooh, a fresh one. I 
I mean, real great practical effects, huh? Yeah. <laughs> she was buried with her glasses? Of course. How, sh how old is she supposed to see in the afterlife? Ooh. Watch your step. Lots of holes. <laughs> <laughs> kind of reminds me of a uh, Hocus Pocus. Yeah. When Billy... Is it Billy? Billy? Yeah, Billy. You know, the dead one. Yeah. Comes out of his grave. Stitched mouth. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, this is much more thriller like, right? Like the zombies are yeah. more thriller esque. Not me. You'll never find me in one of these. I'm going to get me cremated. You're just afraid that some old creep like you is going to come along and steal your head. Watch your tongue, boy, if you like this job. I like this job? Another good reason to be cremated, I guess. Yeah, so can't, your head doesn't get stolen? Can't turn into a zombie, either. Yeah, yeah. Oh, shit. Rod Stewart? Shit. So Rod Stewart? Yeah, I was on it. Watch this. Oh! Oh, gross. Ugh. 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 <laughs> gonna be hard to eat her brains with no mouth, huh? Mm -hmm. She's got a pretty good punch. <laughs> You're supposed to be dead. Oh, you just made him mad now. That's going to be a crier, too. <laughs> crier in this one also, huh? At least these guys aren't as fast as the last one. I know. I'm actually very grateful for that. The last one, they were speedy. These ones are all a little bit stiff. But first we gotta get friends. Come on. No. You just walked right past her. It's me they're after. It's my sin. Hail Mary, full of grace. Quit full of grace. doing this. <laughs> Please. Oh, the over there. Oh. At least they got out of the cemetery. Uh, you started the Hail Mary. Now I feel like I gotta do a whole decade before. Say the whole friggin' rosary in my head now. Thanks, buddy. Lucy, in a cemetery, this hand, he came out of the ground and tried to grab me. I didn't know what to do. Upstairs, mister. No, no that's for home ec. Oh, she's not a good baker, huh? She's still taking home ec. Mom, but do not try to leave this room. Do you understand? <laughs> I was her age. I was baking all sorts of delicious things. <laughs> My mom taught me well. I can't go in, Patrick. Hey, you check those heads. Where do you think you're going? Get your, get your family out of here now. Okay. 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 Mildred. Kid's got some science kits in his room, huh? He's trying to burn the house down? No, he's trying to fake the smoke. Jesse! 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 He's trying to save the world, lady. This is section four. Um, is this the army? <laughs> Is this where you should call about one of those drums? Yes, your name, please. Jesse Wilson? Hold the line, Mr. Wilson. Your call is being transferred. All right! <laughs> should take his address. Immediately. 
Come on, baby, let's go. Oh, but that's stealing! Oh, but that's okay! <laughs> Are you okay? Yeah, yeah, I'm fine. Get started, will you? Did they get another lethal dose of that gassy thing? Probably. Oh, shit. She had some strong teeth. Run, no, they're oh. dead! Yeah, I know! You got already dead! Trust me, dead, dead, dead! Dead, dead, dead! <laughs> oh, Jesus. Joey? Oh boy. Oh Jesus! Oh, Get out of that house. Oh no! Oh. Don't take it out in the house! Oh boy. <laughs> Do you believe your brother now? Why would you stick your finger in its <laughs> mouth? Oh, get rid of it, please! Get rid of it! Oh, get rid of it! Oh, God! Everybody's so weepy and obnoxious. <laughs> she just threw it in the closet? I think so. Or the garage or something? <laughs> oh no. Cut his hair. Oh, jeez. We gotta get out of here. We gotta get out of here. We know that, dummy. We need a car. These three are maybe the most annoying characters <laughs> I've encountered in a while. They might be worse than Shelley Long and the... Or is it Shelley Long? No. The Shining. Yeah. They might be worse than the Shining gal. Yeah. Get her out of here now! What are you gonna do? Goodbye, cable guy. Oh, he did such a good job of protecting them too for a minute. Oh shit! <laughs> Maybe TV didn't exist when he was dead. Definitely not. Maybe. They're all Color like, TV. Ooh. Color TV? Wow. Wow. It's a great distraction. You hide behind a bush? Yeah, that'll help for a while. This way. Come on. Don't freeze, honey. Don't freeze. Okay, they seem to like brains, so maybe they'll leave you alone. Oh, shut up. Come on! <laughs> shut up, dude. Not that. I don't feel so hot. Let me rest. Rest? He wants to rest? Joy, he's totally the Why are we screaming? You think the zombies don't have ears? They're all yelling so loud. Stuck him. George, go get Dr. Mandel. Yeah, George is already dead. Oh, now he's gonna be a zombie. George? 
the worms on her face. Nice touch there, huh? Yeah. Interesting practical effect with the moving worms. <gasps> Uh oh. Ow. Come too. Open up. Sweet car. There seem to be hooligans terrorizing the neighborhood. I, 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 no, no, if the dead, they come back to life. The dead. Dead, dead what? People, we need your car. Well, it sounds to me like you need a hearse. <laughs> I'm sorry, sir, but we've got to get the keys to your car right now. Must be an emergency, huh? No, duh. Oh, well. No, duh. <laughs> oh, my God. It's, it's, um, Harvey. Harvey no, Kramer. No. Harvey, it's me. Remember me? Uh, it wasn't my fault. We ran out of typo. Cherry, <laughs> <laughs> huh? Well, uh, more cherry. No! The door, the door! It's not about to be cherry for much longer. That is a nice car. Bel Air? Is it a Bel Air, you think? Somebody let me know what car that is. I just saw his friend. Mm -hmm. or Not friend. <laughs> not friend. Neighbor kid. <laughs> they got a ride along. They got a clinger. Oh, he's not going to throw up in here now, is he? I mean, what's going on here? Out the window, out the window, open the window, push it back, push it back, push it back, out the window. A car like that went out of automatic windows, would it? Automatic windows? A 30 year old car would not have automatic windows. No, he's winding them up. No, he said push the button, push the button, push the button. <laughs> So much yelling. <laughs> nice. It's not your fault, you cheese dip. Can you stay away from me? Is she called my cheese dick? Probably. Cheese dip or cheese dick? No, it's, it's like we've been here before. <laughs> it's like a dream, this whole thing. You, me, them. Parallel dimensions. <laughs> Anybody here? Her voice is like ales on a chalkboard to me at this point. <laughs> Hello? Where is everybody? They're all being consumed in the cafeteria. Nobody can help us except... Trained physician, such as myself. Ah, yes, yes, yes. What, what, what? When did you two have your last bowel movement? They're constipated, obviously. Uh, so uh, um, Could just ask him to put, to put that in his mouth. Let's... Look at the tongue, all right? <laughs> oh my God! What? What? what <laughs> it's like put that back in there. We're going to do a biopsy. Is it cancer? <laughs> biopsy of what? <laughs> what are you going to biopsy? Him? You know, there's something funny. Yeah, like no people. Yeah. Like Where is everybody? They're all dead already. Oh no, they're getting faster now. Brains make them faster. Apparently. I don't believe this. Me either. You're all gonna die. Great. 
I'm not even out of grade school and I'm already gonna die. This has accepted his fate. Yeah. Look there, lights on. Hey, wait a second. Look, Graham. Hold on. Graham. You should keep it running. Could have just opened the cabinet. <laughs> Junior class champion for the whole state. Here's yours. A terrific, great. Give him the 22. 22. <laughs> <laughs> it's probably got the one that you can handle the kick on. I mean, grab them both, buddy, you know? Make my night. <laughs> Take the 22 also, you know? Take all you can can handle. Look, we gotta get moving. Those things are all over town. <laughs> um, would you come over here, please? What did he biopsy? <laughs> dead? They are not dead, you jerk! Have you noticed she's not breathing? In my opinion, I think they should be contained. Contained? Bag. Bag? Bag. <laughs> Put them in body bags? Bag them and tag them. As if that's going to contain them if they just eat their way out, you know? There's a ham radio in there. Hello? Hello? Ah, oh, shit. He can smell his fresh brains. Okay, <laughs> Had some kick. Yeah. Oh no. Just blew his face off. Only part of it. I find the stairs. Did he find everyone? Oh no. Ooh, bisected him. Must have been a gymnast. Real strong with those arms. Why are you just standing there letting it happen? <laughs> Time to move. What was that? St uh, steam. Li liquid nitrogen or just steam? I think just steam from probably their radiator pipes or something. Until these guys die, they're already dead. I mean, it's just how much longer until they eat her? No! Oh, shit! Now there rides an ambulance. Damn it. A legit song. I'm telling you, Sarge, we cleared out the town. Oh, they cleared the town? How did they know? Because all three of those landed in a similar spot. I gotta get a doctor! Are you sick? No! What is wrong with you? I need help for Christ's sake! Forget it, ladies. Nobody gets out of this town. Why not? They're gonna nuke it. Plague! This is no plague! They're dead! I mean... I mean... I mean, not like for real dead, but like sick dead, you know? Like when you check them out, there's like nothing going on inside or anything. Oh god, she's so annoying. Okay, Sarge. It's Skinner from the X-Files. Oh uh, yeah, let's move out, boy. The head of the department for Mulder. Okay. We'll send the medics, all right? Thomas? Yeah. Ed! Ed! Quit it! <laughs> Go 
Wait a minute, Ed. He's still alive. We're undead. Okay, Sarge. I'm coming. I'm coming. He just left her there? I guess so. I figure she's probably infected too. Don't want to take her with him. Oh no! Oh no! <laughs> so dog brains are okay? Eating all the animals! These guys are smart. Driving Trying to out fly lights. under the radar here. Son of a bitch! <laughs> Doc's like, let him, oh, get me out of here. Let him go. Oh no, he's not gonna let it out. Okay. What are you doing? He's inserting himself into the chaos. It's not gonna kill him. Just gonna make him mad. Maybe that killed it. Oh, Electricity kills it. Great, he turned the friggin' siren on. Good, a beacon. Don't worry, baby. I'm, I'm, I'm gonna get you there. Don't worry. Brains. Let me eat your brains. <laughs> brains! Uh oh. Let me eat your brain. Let me have them. I'm the one who loves you. Uh. Yeah, don't let anybody else get your brains. Let him. I love you. Let me eat your brains. Would you let me eat your brains? If it was either you or someone else, yeah, I'd rather you eat my brains than anyone. Mm. She would have to have jaw. Brain, your brain smells so good. So let me eat your brain. Spicy. Spicy. <laughs> Honey, it's only me. <laughs> okay, okay. Hmm. Okay, eat my brains. Okay. <laughs> It's all right. They're armed. Come in, fire it. I don't think they know that. Right. They wait. You don't understand. I just think they don't care. Well, is there anybody out there? Finn, Finn, you hear me? Let me eat your brain. You tell us where to go. Come to the hospital. Could you tell me who the President of the United States is? Linda B. Johnson. Uh, Harry Truman. <laughs> <laughs> Who's Harry Truman? Some old dead guy. Let me eat your brain. How do you get out of town? No idea. I don't know this town well. I joined the army to see the world, not this. Get hold of yourself, son. You're an American soldier. And the enemy's already dead. You. <laughs> guy's carrying, carrying a bride. A bride. <laughs> Is it a Probably mannequin his, or a his dead bride? bride? Right? If you take out their legs, they can't walk anymore. Sure they can. Uh, did they take That's out those army news. guys? Don't worry, we'll find him. Well, maybe I don't want to find him. I think you do. So they're getting a bunch of cow brains? Looks like it. What's their plan with that? Just slowly throw it out. I don't know. 
Keep those brains coming. Showtime! Showtime! <laughs> What is feeding them? What does that accomplish? Don't know. Oh, maybe electricity does kill them. They're gonna just electrocute all of them. Okay. What does turning up the power do? Brain trap. Mm -hmm. Hope the trap's ready. Run. The walkie talkie. Oh, great. What are we going to do now? The dock. I don't know what to do. He's <laughs> waiting for the signal. <laughs> I don't know. The little kid's gonna have to go. I know that look. Get it from my mom when she wants me to volunteer for dishes. <laughs> Just big enough. Just to honk the horn. Okay, you gotta get it started. Turn the key in the ignition. Hold the clutch in. He doesn't hear the yelling outside. I mean, they've been yelling at the gate the whole time. Who's this? That's the signal. Here we go. Not bad. <laughs> Ouch. Took out the header. Now they've got access to inside the building. You told, you told. Now you die like me. Neighbor holds a grudge. No brains and a big mouth. That's a way to tell him off. Where's the fucking doctor? I should have put the pulled the switch, right? Nope. Doctor's just nowhere to be freaking seen. Well, that's great. At least they found a way to disable these things. That's what the first movie didn't do. I did remember you. Oh. Yeah. Uh. I'm going to run out of power. Oh shit. Live wire. This is thriller. <laughs> Electricity deanimates them. All right. At least we know now. I think that was all the zombies in town. I think that's what they were shooting for, right? You did good, kid. You did all right. Thanks. <laughs> Still a little shit, but I love you. Feelings mutual. Where are their parents? She was babysitting them that night. <laughs> Tell me, my son, have you ever had a Shirley Temple? Uh, horse's neck? No. Shirley Temple sounds good. Don't hit a girl with 
She's down. Okay, no more brain. You win. Oh boy, that was that was brutal. Brutal. I mean, the best part about that movie was that they found a way to actually take care of the zombies, yeah. so it wasn't just like everybody completely died. hopeless. <laughs> yeah, everybody died at the end with a nuke. <laughs> yeah, because that's how uh, the first one was completely yeah. hopeless situation. They figured out how to stop them. Yeah. And there's a love story. And a love story. The cable guy got the girl. Gotta love it. What I like about this one is there's more practical effects. We see lots more of up practical close effects. And personal yeah. zombies. Like the first one is more from a distance, right? We were, yeah, you could tell they they focused a lot on the, the makeup. Yeah. And... So good, good makeup effects. Mm -hmm. I always remember this cover at the video store. Okay. You always know, see it in the horror. I'll be like, that looks scary. I want to see it so it bad. Looks so scary. It does look creepy. Yeah. Yeah. It's a good one. Yeah. And then you had the returning duo who were just as just obnoxious, as obnoxious as the and sad. First and one, yeah. Moni is the first movie. Yeah. So honestly, they were more annoying in this one than they were in the first. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And the girl, wow. Yeah. Well, at least she loved her boyfriend enough to let him eat her brains. Yeah. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Looks like she liked it at the end. Yeah, she did. She was like, uh. <laughs> what was she like? <laughs> But then we had a smart kid as the hero. Yeah. He had a mask and goggles to go get the phone number and try to call for help. Mm-hmm. Just... Smart kid. In the end, save the day. Electrocuting everybody. Yep. So, all right. Well, what is your favorite aspect of the zombies in this franchise? Oh, okay. In the franchise as a whole? Yeah. Hmm. I think it's funny that they speak yeah talk yeah and i don't know that i like like that that's something i like enjoy about it but i think it's funny that that, that's, that that's the case mm -hmm. and i also think it's funny how they really don't give a shit about anything except for the brains yeah there's you know? many brains yeah gotta have more brains gotta have more brains i also appreciated the michael jackson touch there the, the thriller, thriller touch at the end, at the end. yeah, yeah. Because honestly, as soon as they hit the electrical, they were all doing their. Yeah. I was like, this feels like thriller. <laughs> it's like they're all trying to do the dance and they're just bad at it. Yeah. You know? <laughs> yeah. It's always a, a fun little Easter egg yeah. at the end. So Pretty cute. All right. Well, what should people comment on after Return of the Living Dead Part 2? Do you like this one better because of its campiness or do and you prefer the, the original? The effects in this one? Yeah. Which one's. Do you prefer one or two? Mm -hmm. Thanks so much for hanging out with us for part two. Come back next week for something not different. something the same. Not the same. Not the same. Not the same. <laughs> not yeah, the we're same. done with Return of the Living Dead. And check out our Patreon link down below for early access to our videos. One comment and access to pull us up to Pickle Watch next. Link's down there. Check it out. Till next time, have a good one. Bye.